Hello and welcome to another Retro Review Roulette video. In this series, I will be using a random game generator to pick a random retro game that I'm not familiar with to play for around 15 minutes and review it on the fly. I'll point out the good, the bad, and especially the janky, and give it an overall grade at the end. Alright, here we go. Hello and welcome back to another video. Today we're looking at Hit the Ice on the TurboGrafx-16. Uh, so this is a hockey game, and I love hockey games. Probably my favorite sports genre of video game. Um, okay, so let's do versus, I guess. One player computer. Okay, what am I picking? I'm picking my goalie. I think I've maybe played this in the arcade. I'll just pick the default guy, I guess. And then, okay, then you pick one player. Well, this guy looks like Zangief from <laughs> Street Fighter. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go with Zangief. And then, uh, what's happening now? Okay, US versus Canada. Oh, I should have picked Canada. <laughs> I'm Canadian. It would have made more sense. <laughs> oh well, that's okay. I can slum it as an American once in a while. I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, so... What do we got here? It's really... <laughs> it's hard to learn the controls. <laughs> I can't do anything. Okay, so i am got the puck. Um, I passed it. <laughs> I meant to shoot it, but I don't know what the buttons are yet. Okay, so the I don't remember what the layout is for these turbo graphics buttons. I think it's one and two. Okay, so I think number one, which is the button closest to like the um what do you call it? Closest to the center of the pad is the shoot, and the other one is pass. Okay, so I wanna pass. Oh I'm crap. Okay, pass. No, that's shoot. Was that shoot? Oh! <laughs> God, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh! oh I just, like, stabbed a guy. <laughs> this is like Happy Gilmore hockey. My puck, baby! Don't you ever touch my puck! <laughs> yes! Oh, no! I was trying to hack the guy's head off, and I accidentally just didn't control my goalie. <laughs> okay. Well, considering I have never played this before, <laughs> I'm going to say I'm doing okay so far. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, yes! I scored! <laughs> I was... I'm not even kidding. I was not expecting that at all. <laughs> okay. This is pretty fun. Honestly, it's, it's just silly, like, Arcade style hockey. It's it's quite fun actually. Okay. Oh, I hit the shoot button again. Oh. <laughs> okay. So I think the shoot button is also the uh, like attack button. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. What happened to me? I don't. <laughs> I don't know what happened. <laughs> Take that, you jerk. I like that there seems to be a complete lack of penalties. Oh. There's also not a lot of finesse with the game, like, I mean, not that I can figure out anyway, like, um, you know, in the EA NHL games, you know, you'd be trying to position your players for one-timers and stuff like that. There's none of that kind of stuff. It's just, I don't even know if you have a lot of control over where you shoot. It just kind of happens. You just press the button and it just does it. Oh, yeah! See, I was trying to attack the guy, but the attack is the same as the shoot, so I just ended up with the puck and shot it and just scored by accident. <laughs> so I'll take it. <laughs> yeah, this is fun. Like, honestly, if you... If you just like good arcade hockey games, this is fun, really. Um, yeah, I would play this again for sure. It's, an, I'm, it's not a really deep game. Like, you're not going to get a great, like, season or anything, I don't think, out of it, but... Um, it seems pretty basic. But, you know what? That doesn't matter. It's it's an arcade hockey game. It's fun. 
That's the most important thing. Oh, damn it. Did you just punch me in the nuts? <laughs> uh, shoot. <laughs> oh, I think I just keep getting punched in the nuts. Oh, right in the sack. I scored again. I'm amazing. I'm winning 3-1. I'll take it. <laughs> I'm a big fan of the EA NHL games, um, specifically 94 and 96 on the Super NES, and 98 and 99 on the PlayStation 1. Those are my favorite hockey games of all time. I've played some newer ones, some on PS2, some on PS3, just... It's just not the same. They're, they're just too... I don't know. They get too complicated and... Oh! But I love those ones I mentioned. They're fantastic. I've spent a lot of, a lot of days drinking with the buddies and <laughs> playing NHL games. It's a lot of fun. <laughs> uh, but yeah, this one I could definitely see picking up and playing. It's not... Because it's not so super complicated, you can just literally like pick up and play. Oh, look at that. Um, I don't know what the options are as far as, like, if there's any difficulty settings or anything. It seems... I mean, this is my first time playing it, and I'm winning 4-2, to two, so... I don't know if maybe my previous hockey game experience has helped me in this... <laughs> with this, but... Oh, he scored on me. Okay. But, uh... But no, I'm having fun. It's just a nice pick-up-and-play hockey game. Um, I feel like... I feel like there's a lot more basketball games that are kind of like... Oh, oh, I thought I was going to score on my own net. I think there's a lot more basketball games that are kind of like this. Like you got NBA Jam, you got Arch Rivals, um, you know, with mixed results, I guess. <laughs> Some are better than others. Um, but, uh, but yeah, there's not a lot of hockey games that are like this. There's this one, and then... There might be one more somewhere, but I don't remember specifically. Oh, okay. So, if you hold down the button, he does, like, a, a higher shot. And if you just press the button quickly, he does, like, a, a low shot. But it doesn't seem to affect, like, the, the hardness of the shot. <laughs> this is really, like... It really is kind of like, um... NBA Jam f with hockey. <laughs> it's the two-on-two. Two. I think that's what NBA Jam was, wasn't it? Two-on-two? Two. Um, but it's got, like, you know, outrageous attacks and, and stuff like that. Like, it's just sort of way over the top. It's not like it's a simulation or something, right? Um, but yeah, it's just a lot of fun. Like, I'd totally play this with some buddies or something, you know? Like, oh, no! Tied it up! Oh, no! This is only the first period? <laughs> okay, well, I'm not going to play an entire game. <laughs> I feel like I've got enough here that I can make a decision. Um, this, yeah, this is fun. I like this. It, it, for what it is, yes. Yes, I'm just going to finish this first period. I'm going to call it quits after that. Um... <laughs> I can't get over that Zangief guy. That's so funny. <laughs> I wonder if there's any other Street Fighter characters in here. Secret <laughs> Street Fighter characters. Uh oh. Oh. Okay. I'm chalking that up as a win. So. Um. Yeah, I mean, like. Graphics are good. They're nice. You know, nice 16 bit graphics. Um, it's a f it's fun two on two action packed arcade style hockey. Like, I mean, what else can you say? Um, <laughs> it's got a Zangief look alike. I mean, that ups it by a whole point right there. Um, <laughs> so I'm gonna give I'm gonna give um, oh Jesus, what's this game called again? Hit the ice. <laughs> I forgot what it was called. <laughs> Whatever it's called, I'm giving it... Um, I'm going to give it four Zangiefs out of five. <laughs> yeah, let's go with that. Let's go with four Zangiefs out of five for good, fun, arcade-style hockey. Not too serious. Just, you know, having a, a good time. Um, yeah, four out of five. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.